Hey guys, welcome back. So this video is going to be my July Boutique unboxing. So really quickly, the Boutique box is a box full of Korean full-size beauty products. And then there's also the Mask Maven. So these are two different subscriptions through the same company. So you can either sign up for one or you can sign up for both. Everything you need to know will be listed down below as far as pricing and the website and everything. There's also a discount you can get if you'd like to sign up. So make sure you check out the description box. Other than that, we're gonna go ahead and get started with the Boutique Beauty Box. So in it, you get a little card and it tells you everything about the products that you need to know. So this is July and their theme is But First Brunch. So again, they give you a full list and a full rundown of all of the products, including the prices, which I think is so helpful because a lot of times these things don't have English on them, so you don't really know what they are or how to use them. So this card is really helpful. And then I know you love to see the actual inside of the box. So here is what the package looks like. And then here are the fun products. So the first thing I'm so excited about, this is from Urban City and this is the Real Lip Tone Tint. Mine is in the color Rosewood. So this is a lip tint and I'm actually so excited because I've just been really into lip tints lately. So it's so cute. It's like in the shape of like an apple almost. And it's a little bit of like a dusty kind of terracotta red. Lip tints are a really big thing in Asian beauty, so I'm a big fan of them. I think they're really cool. I'd definitely love to have more in my collection. Beautiful shade. Like I said, it's like a terracotta shade almost. It smells beautiful. It's got a very fruity scent, and I love the little glass jar. It looks like a little apple. So what these are supposed to do, they're supposed to leave like a light tint on your lips, basically like you just ate a popsicle or something, and I think these are so great for the summertime. Like... If you want to go to the pool or you want to be out in the sun, it's just kind of a little bit of like color to add to your lips for like no makeup days, no makeup makeup. And see, I even just swiped this off and it wasn't even dried all the way and you can see that it leaves a stain, which is why I love them so much. They're super long lasting and I just like, I like the concept of a lip tint. Again, I'd love to get more of these in my collection. So the next product we have is a moisturizer. This is from the SOM. I think that's how you say it. And this is the Perfumed Body Moisturizer in Apricot. It's kind of like watery. It's not a super heavy like cream type feel. It's definitely got like a more watery consistency. It smells really good. It definitely smells like apricot. I like that a lot. And it also says it has olive oil, sunflower seed oil, and jojoba seed oil. And it does have a very like oily consistency once it dries down, just so you're aware. But I think it will give you like a pretty glow during the summertime. The next product is a serum and they have two different options this month it looks like. So one of them is vitamin B3 and then the one that I got is the hyaluronic acid serum. So this is from a brand called Sarasmin. So it says you're supposed to use one milliliter of the product. So I guess you just push it to the little like milliliter lines and use that amount. So mine's a hyaluronic acid and so this is supposed to give you a dewy glow. And this is a serum so you're going to use this before you put on your moisturizer. So that's pretty cute. I've never seen a product in this kind of dispenser before so I'm excited to give this a try. So the next product is a hair serum and this brand I have no idea how to say it. I've never heard of it so I don't want to butcher it so I will put it in a caption for you. So this is says it has seven times oil so it has seven different oils in it including argan, coconut, olive, apricot, jojoba, marula, and camellia. So you're just supposed to put this on your hair after you have washed it. It says you can also put it on with a shower cap and leave it on for three to five minutes and then rinse it out with lukewarm water. I really like the packaging of this. That's a cool color. It comes out kind of thick, like a lotion almost. It smells pretty good. I like that. So I will definitely have to try this out on my hair for sure. I've never really tried anything like this before. So the next product is a makeup remover sponge. So this is by the brand Sendepin. And so this is the My Honey Clean Sponge. And it says you can use this up to 200 times. And you use this to remove your makeup. You just use water. It says you can use a cleanser, but you don't have to. So it's basically like one of those makeup erasers, which is really cool. I've never actually tried a makeup er eraser before. I was hoping it had like one of those little handles on the back to like hold on to it. But here is what it looks like. That's very cool. I've never tried anything like this. The last thing in this box is a mask. They always include some type of sheet mask. 
So this is by the brand Skin17, and this is the Tea Cafe Latte 3-Step Mask. So you have three different steps to use. So it says it will leave your pores feeling tight and your skin hydrated. So that was everything in the box. Now we're going to move on to the Mask Maven, which is full of sheet masks for the month. So the first little cutie we have here, this is the Skin's Boney, and this is a yogurt bond mini. <laughs> wash off mud pack with green tea this is really cute i've never really tried one of these little tiny like little masks like this before but i see them all the time on like mimi box and places like that and so here are all the different sheet masks i always kind of go through these quickly because there's not like a whole lot to say about them half the time this is cute this is like a little bookmark looking thing this is by candy lady and it's the honey milk candy mask very cool. Honey is really good for your skin. It also acts as an antimicrobial, so it's really great if you have acne or like irritated skin. Then we have the Egg Essence Mask Sheet from Esfolio. I like these little Esfolio masks, and I do like little egg cream masks as well. I like all masks, really. And this is the Annie's Way Bubble Tea Mask, and this is in black tea. I've never tried this brand before. It says firming, nourishing, and brightening. Then we have a tomato mask from the Somme, and this is a tomato natural tox mask sheet. It says it contains lycopene, vitamin A, and K to provide moisture and elasticity to the skin. That's very cute, huh? It says natural color energy, so is this going to be red? I wonder. Oh, and here's the card. See, they usually provide a card in the masks as well because a lot of times I don't know what they're for, like what they're supposed to do. Here's that. Oh, okay, I get it. So they're brunch themed. So they have oatmeal and then they have drinks and then they have omelets. So they have like all the stuff to make an omelet with like the egg mask and the tomato mask. That is super cute. So we have three masks to go. So this is the Papa Recipe Bombi Honey Mask. And it also brightens your face as well. Cool. So this goes in the oatmeal category. That's so cute. Then we have an oatmeal mask. This is from the Somme. They're putting a lot of Somme stuff in here, this box. And this is just a moisturizing mask. Oatmeal is very soothing as well. I really like oatmeal in my skincare ingredients. And then the very last mask is a pomegranate mask from Foodaholic. Which this isn't on the card anywhere, so maybe this was, I don't know, I don't know if everyone's getting this mask, but it says it makes your skin healthy through removing dead skin cells and, man and maintains your skin smooth through improving skin elasticity. Well, we'll just see about that. Okay guys, that's everything that I got this month in my boutique unboxing. Let me know what your favorite products were. I love doing these unboxings. I always get so excited about them every single month. So make sure you check out my playlist and also stay tuned for my next unboxing, which will come sometime in a couple of weeks for August. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.